Hi, let me show you some code. Here we speak of two conventional interfaces, the iterator and iterable interfaces. An iterator is an object with an next method. When invoked, that method yields an object with two properties, a value and a boolean called down. Down is true when the iterator is exhausted. In this code, we define the makeIterator function that takes an array and returns an iterator over this array. Invoking repeatedly o.next yields successively the different values contained in the array. So here we call o.next first time and get a value of a and down is false. We do it a second time and we get this record with value and down and we do it a third time and now the iterator is exhausted. An iterable object has a specific method that returns an iterator. Iterable objects can be iterated with a special looping instruction, the for of construction. The name of that specific method is not a string, it is a symbol. And this symbol is obtained by the global expression symbol.iterator. So after reinitializing our iterator in variable O, we create the iterable and we enumerate all the values of the iterable by the for of instruction and we print every term as we can see here.